Hi guys, in this video we are going to learn how to draw flowchart to find simple interest. Here we have to find simple interest using flowchart. Flowchart. Flowchart is a graphical representation of solved problem. Here we are using different geometrical shapes that is oval shape, rectangular, parallelogram shape, diamond shape to draw flowchart. Flowchart is always start with start statement. It is writing within the oval shape. Start. Next, we have to read input values. Input values is always writing within a parallelogram shape. To find simple interest, formula is SI is equal to PTR divided by 100. Here, P is principal principal next t is time r is rate of interest p is principal t is time r is rate of interest so here we have to read input values p t and r p is principal T is time, R is rate of interest. So here we have to read input values, input variables that is P comma T comma R. P is principal, T is time, R is rate of interest. Next we have to draw rectangular shape. Within that we have to write our process that is SI is equal to our formula is P into T into R divided by 100. Got it? P into T into R divided by 100. Next, we have to display the output, right? Output is always writing within a parallelogram shape. Within that, we have to print our simple interest that is SI. We have to print SI here. Next, finally, we have to stop the flowchart using stop statement. It is writing within a oval shape. So, guys, this is the flowchart to find simple interest. It is start with start statement. It is writing within a oval shape. Flowchart is always start with start statement. It is writing within a oval shape. Next, we have to read input values. Input values is always writing within a parallelogram shape. Within that, we have to write, read P, T, R. P is principal here. T is time. R is rate of interest. Next, we have to calculate simple interest using formula SI is equal to P into T into R divided by 100. Formula is or calculation is always writing within a rectangular shape. Next, we have to print output is using parallelogram shape. Within that, within parallelogram shape, we have to write output. Here, we display the output print SI. Finally, we have to stop the flowchart using stop statement. It is writing within a oval shape. In flowchart, start and stop statement is always writing within a oval shape. Input and output statement is writing within a parallelogram shape and process is writing within a rectangular shape. So guys, this is the flowchart to find simple interest. If you like my video, please like and subscribe my channel. Thank you for watching. All the best.